In this tutorial, I'll show you how to upload this domino scene that I made in a previous tutorial to the internet. You can download the file from my website or you can follow the previous tutorial and make it yourself. Blend for Web allows you to export 3D scenes to web formats. The simplest option is to export the 3D scene as a single HTML file. Select the place where you want to save the file and click export. In Google Chrome web browser you can open a HTML web page file by holding down the control key and pressing O for open. Select the domino scene file and click open. The scene loads and the interactivity provided by the logic nodes works. When I click on the sphere, the platform tilts, but the physics doesn't work. For scenes that use physics and for advanced uses of blend for web you have to export in the blend for web JSON format. You have to upload multiple files to a web server. blend for web provides project manager which will manage the multiple files. In this tutorial I'm going to use Project Manager to upload the domino scene. I'm going to make two changes before I upload the scene. Click the World button and click Render Sky. I want to make one more improvement. Add Layout Reroute. If the user doesn't click on the sphere, if there is a miss, I want the Switch Select Reset. Next I'm going to use Project Manager to make the files that I need to upload to the internet. Click the Render button, click Project Manager. Click Hide Stock Projects so that Project Manager only displays my projects. Click Create New Project. I'm going to call the project My Domino. I put My in the file name so out of the many files that there are, I know which ones I created. Create application starter files, HTML files, JavaScript files and CSS files, I would say is essential. Create scene starter files, the Blender file, JSON and BIN files. These files will be overwritten, but I recommend that you do create them. Those are all the settings we need. Scroll down and click Create Project. And once the project is created, click Back to Projects. When we click the link for the Domino HTML file, the Blend for Web default scene is loaded. To get our Domino scene to load, we need to overwrite the Domino JSON file, and to do that, we need to overwrite the Domino Blender file. To overwrite the Blender file, go back to Blender. In the File menu, Save As, go to the Blend for Web folder, the Projects folder, My Domino, Blender, select the mydomino.blend file and click save as to overwrite it. Going back to project manager, the Blender file has now been overwritten, but it will have no effect unless the JSON file is overwritten, and there are two ways to do that. Going back to Blender, file, export, Blend for Web JSON, and this will not work unless the file is saved in the correct folder with the correct name. The correct folder is the Blend for Web folder Projects My Domino Assets, and the correct file name is mydomino.json. It will default to these values, but if they're changed for any reasons, it won't work. Click Export. And that will overwrite the JSON file. 
The other method is to click the re-export scenes link and that will run a script that will do everything for you but if for any reason it doesn't work you have to go back and do the blender method. Now clicking the HTML file we get the domino scene Clicking Build Project makes smaller versions of the text files. And clicking Deploy Project puts all the files that need to be uploaded to the internet into a zip file. The contents of the zip file need to be unzipped. I can do that on my Windows 10 system by double clicking to go into the file, selecting the contents, right click copy, go out of the zip file, right click and paste, double clicking to go inside the unzipped folder. All these files and folders need to be uploaded to a web server. This is the file manager for my web server. This is the domino scene uploaded to a folder linked to one of my domains, hotanimation.co.uk. If I double click to go into the folder, we see the files I uploaded from the zip file. If you use FTP, File Transfer Protocol, you can copy all the files and folders in one go. If you don't use FTP, then you have to make the folders yourself and copy the files into them. I used New Folder to make the Assets folder. If I double click to go inside it, we see the domino scene encoded in the JSON format. If there were image files or sound files packed into the Blender file, then they would also go in the Assets folder. I also made the Common folder, which contains the Blend for Web library files. You actually only need three files, b for w simple minjs and the two Uranium files. My Domino HTML is the web page to load into a browser and you need to give the full path to the file. This is the path to the file and if I copy the web address and paste it into a browser we load the 3D scene from the internet That's the end of the tutorial. I'll put the Domino file for you to download at my website. Click the link or the eye icon. If you'd like to subscribe, click the link or the stick man. If you'd like to sponsor my tutorials, click the link. Thanks for watching and goodbye.